Hello my dear students welcome to your favorite channel where we are going to start off with a new chapter on this new year so i hope all of you have enjoyed your new year to the fullest but yes keeping safe at your home itself राइट सिनेरियो इज नॉट दैट गुड एंड आई ऑल्सो होप कि आप सब ने हमारा लास्ट सेशन दैट इज गुड बाय टू ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी वन ऑल्सो यू हैड इंजॉय टू इट्स फुलस्ट सो ग्रेट सिक्स टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट विद न्यू चैप्टर दैट इज रेशो एंड प्रपोर्शन but before we move ahead here's a small introduction of your master teacher priya ma'am so for all the new joiners on our channel in this new year let me tell you about myself so if you want to know about my educational qualifications i have done my bed my ctet my bcom and right now also i am pursuing my masters in economics if you talk about the passions which i have I love making handmade crafts all sudoku puzzles I also love visiting NGOs where I teach the brilliant children like you and if you talk about the achievements so I love the way you all give it up in the feedback right in the comment box in the chat box ma'am you have taken away the fear of mathematics that's the biggest achievement each and every day if you talk about the skills yes I love conducting fun engaging activities in your session so that you all are more comfortable with the subject and you are no more fear of mathematics you do not have the phobia of mathematics now right aur agar aap languages ki baat kare jo mujhe pata hai that is hindi and english i prefer using these two languages generally right and if you want to know more about your priya ma'am then follow me on instagram by the id of priya underscore vedantu where you will get to know more about me and now let's move to the session plan for our day so first important thing what we are going to cover is the homework solution the homework which i gave you in the previous session i hope aap sab ne homework kiya tha right then obviously we should know the importance of the topic he why we are studying this particular topic there will be an amazing math code for all of you to encourage you to do more mathematics problems then you will be getting a shout out by priya ma'am for the yt lovers to jitne bhi bachcho ko nahi pata ki what is yt lovers stay tuned to the session entering in movies world so we all know that you love movies right so today i have come up with some bollywood movie story for all of you so after entering in the movies world you will be having summary of the session we'll also be revealing the answer homework question will be there for you and also the homework winners right so let's move ahead and have the homework solution for everyone so in the previous session you had the homework the number of bacteria in a culture is x now it becomes square of itself after one week so what will be its number after two weeks so in the beginning it is x after one week it will be x square after two weeks it will be x square squares so that will be x raised to the power 4 so here we are using a concept that if you need to expand this Exp uh, exponential form right so let's move ahead and now we are going to know about the importance of this topic ratio and proportion which is very 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 important and we keep using it uh, it in our daily life as well so let's see the first one so here we use it in our daily life to simplify many of our interactions by putting the numbers into perspective like you might have heard this bag is two times the weight of another bag that is actually ratio we'll get to know more about it and yes also ratio allows us to measure like how i told you right now express quantities by making them easier to understand now it was easy to know that the first bag is double heavier than the second bag right ratios are used to compare values so we also need to compare values there also you will use the concept of ratios in life and kids will need to connect their understanding of multiplication and division with real world problems using ratios so all these are the importance of the topic and now is the mathematics code for all of you which tells us that mathematics may not teach us how to add love or subtract hate right but it gives us every reason to hope that every problem has a solution so whenever you have any problem in life just think over to it 
हेयर एंड डेयर यू विल गेट अ सोल्यूशन टू इट कुछ भी हो उसका कोई ना कोई सोल्यूशन आपको जरूर मिल जाएगा सो कीप सोचिंग फॉर द सोल्यूशन एंड नाउ इट्स टाइम फॉर प्रिया मैम टू गिव अ वाइट ई लव अर शाउट आउट टू आर अमेजिंग पीपल ओवर देअर फर्स्ट शाउट आउट गोज टू कृष्णा सिंह देन आराध्या सिंह जानवी नीरज लिखिता मयूराक्षी स्टेफी सविता मनोज एंड यति भारती थैंक यू सो मच गाइज फॉर टेकिंग आउट योर टाइम एंड लेटिंग एस नो इन द कॉमेंट बॉक्स दैट हाउ वॉज द सेशन राइट इट रियली मीन्स दैट वेन यू आर अटेंडिंग एनीथिंग यू शुड ऑल्सो गिव योर फीडबैक फॉर इट एंड आई हैव टेकन फ्यू ऑफ द फीडबैक्स द कॉमेंट्स आर देयर टू शो एवरीबाडी सो एकता खुराना सेज मैम टूडे सेशन वॉज अमेजिंग आई यूजली हैड प्रॉब्लम इन दिस चैप्टर But after watching, I got all my doubts cleared. Thank you so much, Ekta. I love you too, Bacha. You are amazing, and your methods are the best. Thanks. Yes. So here is a big hat to Ekta. Janvi says the session was great. I can understand exponents clearly. That's amazing. Savita says the session was super and fantastic. Thank you, Savita. Netra says I enjoyed the session so much. Thank you for the session. Yes. so a big hat to all of you and all those students who are thinking that how come they get a shout out by priya ma'am so yes you can also get that so keep putting your feedback right after the class in the video in the comment box so that i can pick up the feedbacks and tell you right after the session i will be watching the feedbacks also so as we all know that knowledge increases by sharing so spread it by bringing all your friends to the session quickly You have few seconds to share the session with your friends. I hope आप सबको पता है that how do we share a session on YouTube, right? जल्दी से the more number of friends we have in the class, the more we are going to learn also by interacting with them, right? So now let's move ahead, and here I am going to show you my weekly schedule for the first week of January 2022. So all those who have missed out any of the sessions till now, do watch the replay of it. the timings are mentioned for you what is the topic which we are going to cover and also the upcoming sessions so do share this weekly schedule take a screenshot for yourself and now it's time for everybody to mark your attendance kaise mark karte hain hum apni attendance by giving a big fat thumbs up to the class comment box mein apna comment likh ke where you get the vital lover shout out by sharing it with your friends and also the most important by becoming a family member of such a huge family on vedantu young wonders how come by subscribing to the channel on the right bottom so now it's time for everyone to let's enter into movies world so are you all ready yes let me know right away are you all ready for this i know right first time we are entering into the movies world and it's 2022 let's start with the first example over here so first of all can you write the ratio of lions to bird in the below poster ratio of lions to birds is the below poster so first of all you should find out the number of lions then the number of birds and whatever is before two in ratio that number has to be written first so lions are six in number birds is just one so it is 6 is to 1 and we all know ki fractions can be expressed as ratios also right so ab chalte hain apne pehle example pe let's understand the ratio concept by father and daughter's weight so i am going to show you an image and i hope you all remember which movie is this who can tell me yes 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 and what's the name of the character what's the name of the daughter over here anyone yes Yeah, you all are right. It is from kuch kuch hota hai. So now, here the name of the daughter was Anjali, right? So Anjali's weight is taken as twenty five kg, and Rahul's weight, right? Father Shah Rukh Khan's weight is taken as seventy five kg. So how many times Rahul's weight is of Anjali's weight? How many times? If someone asks you to compare, yes, twenty five and seventy five, it is three times. because 3 times of 25 is 75 so we can clearly say over here ki rahul's age is 3 times of anjali's age right so in the above example we have compared two quantities in terms of how many times so jab bhi hum koi cheez ko compare karte hain in how many times right 
सो दैट कंपेरिजन इज कॉल्ड नथिंग बट इट्स रेशो ओनली ये जो इतना मुश्किल आपको कॉन्सेप्ट लगता है ये है नहीं इट्स जस्ट बाय कंपेयरिंग हाउ मेनी टाइम्स एंड व्हाट इज द सिंबल व्हिच वी यूज इट्स अ कोलन लाइक दिस राइट दिस इज द रेशो सिंबल नाउ लेट्स टेक अप अनदर एग्जांपल ओवर हियर सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी कैन से दैट द रेशो ऑफ फादर्स वेट टू अंजलीज वेट इज 3 इज टू 1 इट इज 3 इज टू 1 राइट लेट्स मूव अहेड एंड सी अनदर एग्जांपल Now I have a scene from a very famous comedy movie. Can you all tell me the name of the movie right now? Yes. Are you able to recall the name of the movie? Let's see. Let's see. Yes, in the comment box, in the chat box, let me know which. What is the name of this movie? Yes, you all are right. It's Three Idiots. So here in this class, there are twenty boys and forty girls. So what is the ratio of number of girls to number of boys? So see, two is written. so before two you have girls so what are the number of girls it's given 40 so we should take 40 first so 40 upon 2 it will give you 2 is to 1 first of all you need to simplify them right because ratios are also to be expressed in simplest form always jaise ki humne ye concept padha tha fractions chapter mein bhi right so here second example same class Now, what is the number of boys ratio to the total number of students? So this time we are not comparing the boys and the girls number. We are comparing the number of boys to the total number of students out there. So it is total number of boys upon total number of students. That is, we need to add the number of boys and girls both. So it is twenty upon sixty. So zero zero gets cancelled. You are left with one upon three, which is actually One is to three, so this is the ratio. When they ask you to find out for number of boys to the total number of students, right? Let's take another example now. So here we are not taking any movie, but we are going to compare the height of these two super actors, Akshay Kumar and Ajay Devgan. But can we compare their heights? I don't think so. Why? Because the heights are in different units. If the units are not the same, we cannot compare the quantities. So first of all, हमे पता होना चाहिए what is the relationship between centimeter and millimeter, and you should convert them in one unit. And we would prefer to convert it in the smaller unit always, right? So here, Ajay Devgan's height is one seven five zero millimeter only, but Akshay Kumar's height was given in centimeter. Which we are going to convert in millimeter. How come, ma'am? One centimeter has ten millimeter, so multiply by ten. Because we are going from a higher unit to a smaller unit. अब हम ratio निकाल सकते हैं. So they are saying to keep the height of Akshay Kumar first. So it is one seven eight zero upon one seven five zero. Again zero zero gets cancelled, and we get the ratio. So do not forget the important point over here that two quantities can be compared only if they are in the same unit. Only if they are in the same unit, right? Let's move ahead and see another example now. Eiffel Tower and Burj Khalifa's height is given to us. The ratio is given this time. So what are we going to do? Ratio is given. This time we are going to find how to find the equivalent ratio. अब ये इक्विवेलेंट रेशियो में वर्ड इन इट सेल्फ हैज द वर्ड इक्वल तो नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू फाइंड आउट सम रेशियोस व्हिच विल बी इक्वल टू द रेशियो ऑफ हाइट ऑफ आइफेल टावर टू बुर्ज खलीफा सो लेट्स सी हाउ कैन वी फाइंड आउट द इक्वल रेशियोस ओवर हियर सो देयर आर टू डिफरेंट वेज फर्स्ट इज द रेशियो इज ऑलरेडी गिवन यू कैन डिवाइड इट बाय इट्स हाईएस्ट कॉमन फैक्टर so the ratio which we get after dividing it in the highest common factor is one of the equivalent ratios to the given ratio second if you see you can also find out its equivalent ratios by multiplying it with any non zero integer it's not compulsory that every time you have to multiply it by two only you can multiply it by any non zero integer and the new ratio which you get is also the equivalent ratio to the given ratios like this we can find out so many ratios 
to a given ratio. So what are equivalent ratios? We get equivalent ratios by multiplying or dividing the numerator and denominator by the same number. By the same number. Either you can multiply also or divide also. Right? These two can also be divided by 4 as well. So usse bhi jo hume ratio milti that will also be an equivalent ratio. So aise hum ek ratio ke bahut sare equivalent ratios nikal sakte hain. Right? So stay tuned to learn more with me right now and here is a very important information. So we know all aap sabke exams are right? Let me know in the comment box in the chat box right now that when are your exams starting? Jaldi se bata dije. I hope all of you have got your date sheets. A tentative date sheet from school. When are your exams starting? So at Vedantu the revision classes have started. The crash courses have started. So here you can join us for all your queries like do you have doubts? Do you need more conceptual clarity for the topics which are already done in your curriculum? You need more questions and assignments. Are you lagging behind in your syllabus? Looking for a revision plan that how should I start my revision for the whole curriculum for final exams? Do you prefer learning in Hindi or English? Konsi ek language mein agar aap padna chate sif? So for this, Vedantu has come up with the live and interactive crash courses for all of you jahan pe aapko sari online classes milenge with high level of quizzes entire syllabus will be covered again with the revision by the handwritten notes of the master teachers with practice questions many quiz questions and also the notes made by the experts will be there at your tips you just have to download them it's free of cost Doubts aapke clear honge, there will be other class teachers who will be taking up your doubts. During the class itself, also post class will be there. Topic wise assignments will be given for practice because we know it's only practice which can make us perfect, right? Mock test will be taken where you will be getting detailed report so that you are more confident enough ki hum kaha pe garbar kar rahe hai when we are doing the questions by ourselves. And your percentage will be improved. Thousands of micro courses will be there for free of cost. So suppose if you are done with the chapter, you will have to do chapter with the teacher. Ke so you can enroll to that micro course which will be free for you. So grade 6, 7, 8 crash course ka full slaver start ho gaya hai for CBSC, ICSC, Maharashtra board everywhere. So I am taking, Priya ma'am is taking your CBSC grade 6, 7, 8. So if you want to enroll, I am going to show you right now that how can you enroll. So the link is given in the description box. You just need to click on to the link and you will come to this beautiful page. Right. So let me go off the screen and show it to you. Here you need to choose your grade. Chika, suppose you have grade 6 choose. Kiya. So as you can see there are different grades mentioned. You can share it with your elder brother sisters, your younger brother sisters as well. Once it's done then you need to choose your crash course right which course you want to learn and as you can see grade 6 and 7 a combined uh, batch has also started not a batch actually a combined two years package is also there where you can save money so you can tell your juniors as well so grade 6 suppose abhi aapko crash course karna right so you come to this select your things target exam and your grade then you will see that there are two different options available for you that is pro light and pro classic. Up the fees is given to you. But will you enroll in this fees? No, you have an amazing offer. So here you need to go on to apply coupon code. Put P-J-A-P-R-O and click on apply. So you will see you have instantly saved 10%. Same happens in the classic one. Up difference kya hai ma'am dono mein? In classic one you will also get a mobile app. Jahan pe aap apne doubts dal sakte hai. From morning 8 o'clock till 11 o'clock at night and your doubts will be resolved within minutes by our experts over there. Right? So here you can see the different batches are starting. This is how the timetable will be provided to you. 3rd January, new batches have begun so you can join us and this is the plan which I was telling you. Right? You get instant 10% discount so note down the coupon code it's p j a p r o and there are students who need the doubt solving on mobile app also they should choose the classic plan right there also they are getting the discount right so these are the 
prices which you are getting and the link is given to you in the description box in the pinned comment just put the code and do not let this new year offer go for anybody do not miss out this opportunity 10 percent discount is going on for everybody the batches have started on 3rd january new batches are also beginning 3rd january just a class humne liye abhi tak. so you can enroll to us and the classes will be regular everything classes practice questions quizzes everything will be provided to you the premium batches are also starting where the full slavers crash course will be done and all those who are coming to these grades the new batches the new year batches have also begun everything is there for you all at vedantu so now let's summarize what all we had learnt in our session today right summary very important a quick recap for everybody a more meaningful comparison has to be done between the quantities using division that is how many times one quantity is to the other quantity or is method ko hum bolte hai comparison by ratio or comparison by ratio ke liye the units should always be the same if the units are not the same then you should make the units same first then only ratio can be found out a ratio can also be expressed in its lowest form right and two ratios are equivalent if the fractions corresponding to them are equivalent so we have also learned what are equivalent ratios today so revise everything i'll be seeing you in the next class so do let us know in the comment box what more are you looking forward to in our sessions over the session and here is the homework question where you will get to know about more and more practice right so practice do put up your answer in the comment box so that i can see your answers do put it up in detail that how did you solve and your name will be there in the next class homework winners list so previous sessions homework winners are netra anand vijay rani chandrasekhar abir and mamta bhatti keep doing the great job guys and yes this is how you will go ahead and this is Priya ma'am's Instagram ID. So follow me over there to know more about your Priya ma'am, to know more about the links of the sessions and more about your Vedantu Young Wonders. And very soon we are going to come up with new series. So stay tuned to the channel which is really going to help you in the exams as well. So do let me know in the comment box when are your exams starting and we will help you out in that. So once again showing you the weekly schedule for this week for Priya ma'am on Vedantu Young Wonders so that you do not miss out any of the sessions and right now this is the telegram group where you can join us for all the latest updates of your channel. So give a big fat thumbs up to the session if you have enjoyed the session mark your attendance by it share it with your friends put it up in the comment box how was the session and when is your exams and put up your homework answer as well. So subscribe to the channel and thank you so much guys for your precious time till we meet next. Take care of yourself. Stay safe. This is your mathematics master teacher Priya ma'am signing off for the day. Bye bye.